Good morning from another beach. Close up the curtain. Stay on the phone. We are the monsters holding you still. Good morning from another beach. Uh, this time I'm in Wassymouth. Um, family weekend, we're going to the colours of Clooney, so staying in Elgin, and I thought, why not go up to sunrise? We are the monster. There's no place to hide. Standing on the beach waiting for the sun to come up, we've got Cove Sea Lighthouse in the background and uh, quite a strong wind, so I'm hoping that this has been picked up alright. I'll get my back to the wind to try and minimise wind noise. Uh, and what we've got, or what I'm looking at for my composition, because I wasn't quite sure what to, uh, to expect. Um, I'd done a bit of research online because I've never been before and found that there are rocks and whatnot, but because of this wind, we're getting a lot of wind blown sand, which you may or may not see screaming past the camera. Um, so, what I'm thinking of doing is I will uh, set up. sand as my sort of foreground and leading line uh, take me in towards the lighthouse so uh, it'll be a matter of timing once we've actually got light uh, it's a bit cold so I'm gonna we'll go around make sure I'm sorted and uh, we'll uh, hopefully capture something of interest I think we're starting to see the first signs of some of the light. Um, it's just behind the camera at the moment. I'm starting to see a little bit on the on the rocks underneath the lighthouse. Um, thankfully, the wind's still staying strong because I'd be a bit stuck if it dropped and the sand stopped doing what it was doing. I'm hoping I'll be able to capture that. Uh, so, yeah, um, I just set, set up. I'm using my 24 to 70. Uh, not really seeing any reason to go any wider than that because even it, even with that one, I'm uh, I'm sitting at about 50 mil. So we'll see what the exposure is. There's some colour appearing in the sky. I've got a, a nice bank of clouds sitting in behind the, the lighthouse. So I'm kind of hopeful that that will pick up colour uh, to give the sky some interest. The edges of it are starting to be a bit pink tinged. So fingers crossed. Uh, I was thinking of being a bit further along um, where the rocks are, but this will do if it works. If it doesn't work, we'll, we'll move further up the beach and see if we can get something else. Uh, I think we're on an incoming tide, so I'm a bit wary of that because uh, having walked along from Wassymouth, I've noticed that there's not much beach at high tide, so uh, I don't know how quickly it'll come in. So we will, hopefully won't get cut off and have to walk back through the, the dunes. We've got the light pretty much up, sun's up, big. It's a bit diffused still, so there's maybe a bit of haze or something in the atmosphere. Um, but we've got quite a nice light on the lighthouse and on a couple of points on the rock. There's, um, I think it looks like an old pillbox or something, probably dating back to the last war. 
um, and it sits on the edge of the rocks or the cliffs. There's a bit of light just beneath that. We found homes in these walls. We like what we saw. Seems so strong until it falls. The fire. Quickly run through my setup again. Uh, 24 70 set at about 50 mil, um, and I've been shooting shooting manual uh, f11, and it's given me just short of a second's exposure, which has been enough because I don't want to go too long, otherwise I lose the sand. Um, so it's been in, the other thing that's helping with the sand is that the wet sand's still quite dark. Whereas the windblown stuff is obviously drier sand and it's much whiter, so it stands out against the, the darker background. Um, so I think that will be us for the morning. Um, it's quite cold in this wind. Uh, I'm sitting here with several layers on and it's still starting to feel a bit chilly. So I think. Maybe take a couple more shots just before I pack up, but uh, I think that'll be us done for here. So. Thank you for watching. Um, if you have enjoyed this or if you'd like to continue to keep up with what I'm doing then please subscribe. Uh, if you have any comments or anything that I've uh, been talking about or uh, things you'd like clarified then please leave a comment below. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching and goodbye from Lossy Mouth. Let's take this walk together